I'm Zafira. I'm Wani. I'm Hanis. I'm Farah. Fermentation is an incomplete breakdown of glucose in condition of limited oxygen or without oxygen. Fermentation can be divided into two types which are alcohol fermentation and lactic acid fermentation. Alcohol fermentation is an incomplete breakdown from glucose to ethanol, carbon dioxide and also energy. While lactic acid fermentation is an incomplete breakdown from glucose to lactic acid and also energy. The concept of fermentation applied in the making of appams would be alcohol fermentation using yeast. Yeast is eukaryotic, a single cell microorganism which is classified as one of the fungus type. Yeast is used as a leavening agent in the process of fermentation which is essential in making appams. The purpose of leavening is to produce carbon dioxide that makes the dough rise. This does this by feeding the sugars in the flour and releasing carbon dioxide as the product. Thus, the dough will rise and become soft, like my lovely teddy bear. A few moments later
One Eternity Later 1. Can experience the crispy and thin texture of appam. Furthermore, appam can be served during breakfast or dinner. Good news, 1 unit of appam only consists of 99 calories and is low on cholesterol. This is a good, healthy choice for dieters for weight loss. To have better engagement with our target, we must have an effective marketing plan. Therefore, setting up stores at strategic places is very important. This is to make sure our product is clear and visible to potential buyers. There is promoting our product. They can share the link on social media, in a blog post, or even in a YouTube videos where they are showing off our product. Lastly, we could ask bloggers and entrepreneurs to share our product to their followers. Bloggers and entrepreneurs have the power to influence their loyal followers. Lots of people tend to try new products when the products are shared or recommended by others.
Bye.